Okay, so Roblox Bed Wars had an update where they added solos and other stuff. Those things are not relevant though. But anyways, I completely dominate everyone in solos. Hope you enjoy. The first thing I did was look around and since there is no teammate, they won't be stealing my resources. I then gathered supplies and went to Cyan base because Cyan left and this time I did not break the bed because it could be useful. I bought myself a wooden axe and some blocks and I decided to rush pink. Making my way down to this base, I'm rushing pink because I'm confident. Do 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 do. Easy break. Do 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 do. Nice win. After singing something completely cringe, I decide to rush once again and I juke that dude. Then I break his bed and spawn kill that dude. Then I rush someone again because why not? And yellow had no defense, so I one tap the bed. But then the player came back and I thought I could knock him off the board, but I completely failed because I'm bad. I bought myself leather armor and was going to rush that dude again, but I suddenly turned left and I saw a dude, so I stayed at my base a little longer. Then this dude started building up and I know he was going to rush me, so I started to build my bed defense. Then this dude jumped down by combo him and killed him. Let's go! I like to take revenge, so I decided to rush red and I saw that dude with an iron sword, so I was planning on knocking him off, but then this dude built up, so I knew I was going to lose, so I tried to do a bed trade, but that dude jumped down. I knew he was low on health, so I rushed him again and was about to crush his base, but remember when I spared that bed? The yellow just broke that bed, and I knew he was close to my base. I was low on health, so I had to come up with a plan, so I waited a little, then I attack him and knock him in the void. Now all I need to do is defeat Red and I win, and I saw him coming and he built up, but I did not hesitate and book it for his base, even if it cost my bed, and he broke my bed, and I knew he was going to void, so I was taking a risk. I broke the bed on Tommy and started spamming my sword on that spawn, and he actually void, and I won. And I also said GG. Alright, second game, I look around and went back to my gen. Also, if you want to support me, make sure to buy this donation t-shirt. It's in my group. After self-promoting, I decided to rush Cyan, and that dude just fell, so I broke the bed and spawn killed that dude. I then decided to gather more supplies and decided to rush green, but he noticed me, so we had a bridge fight, but he fell, so I got the bed, then I dip. I then bought leather armor and decided to rush green again to finish him off. I then decided to rush green, so I built up banging him to come up, then I jumped down and was so close to breaking the bed. Moral of the story, always get an iron axe. So that's what I did, I bought an iron axe and decided to rush orange once again. But I failed because I went in first person, oh my gosh, I'm actually so bad. But then I saw purple finishing my job so I just decided to go to mid. But then I saw pink coming towards my base so I quickly bridged to my base and luckily he only had a pickaxe so I got there in time and finished him off. I then bought myself an ender pearl and TNT and was planning to rush that guy who rushed me. While I was rushing that dude, I misplaced my TNT and he was coming back so I knew I had to dip. I checked in case but unfortunately it did not have a hole. Luckily, he did not chase me. I then gathered more supplies to rush him again. I then saw that he was leaving, so this was my perfect opportunity to rush him. But then I saw him coming back, so I stole his iron, and I know I can beat him in a 1v1. After winning, I decided to get a diamond pickaxe. I don't know why I just didn't get TNT, but then I just built up. I then waited until my health was full before attacking him again.
My health was almost full, so I went back to first person, then I jump in and attack him, and I was winning, then he got me into this combo, but I break out of it. I then started mining and got the bed in time, and I ran and built up because I'm coming for blood. I then saw a player that was in middle so I had to finish this off quickly so I jumped down too early but of course I was losing so I built back up. I sat here patiently but then this dude started building up and I was low on health so I just tried to knock him off but I failed. I then decided just to go mid and I saw them doing it out so I just third party them. And I also said GG. Alright, third match, it's the same map as the first game but anyways, I decided to rush Tanker and I actually destroyed Tanker and broke his bed. Then I spawn killed Tanker, oh my gosh, I'm so pro, no cap. After defeating Tanker, I decided to rush once again and Orange built an upside down T. I don't know what that is about. But anyways, I broke his bed and finished him all because I'm pro. I then decided to rush once again. Man, what is it with me rushing people? But anyways, I killed Pink then broke his bed and spawn killed that dude. It's the same process. I then did this 2000 IQ call jumping in the void and you may think it's on accident but it's actually on purpose so I could rush red, definitely not on accident. Stop the cap! <laughs> I then rush red, that was the whole purpose of me falling in the void. I then build up and jump him when he least expected it. After destroying him, I broke his vent and built up and waited until my health was full. He then went into his house, so I jumped down and 1v1 him. After the thing red, I went back to my base because I felt like I was going to get rushed, and I was right. And this was a close battle. I survived with 5 hearts. I then decided to rush blue, but I got knocked into the void. I need an advantage, so I decided to win mid to get emeralds. I then bought myself diamond armor and was going to rush the last person. And this dude also thought the same way. And I also said GG.